If you're an Australian Year 12 student in 2024, here's how you apply for uni through UAC. To get started, head to the UAC website, uac.edu.au. Click the Apply or Login button and select Undergraduate Application from the drop-down menu. Read the information on the Start page. Take particular note of the application fee. Click the Start Your Application button. Register your application by entering your personal email address and a password. You'll be emailed a link to verify your email address. Once that's done, go back to the application start page and log in using your registered email address and password. Select your citizenship and tell us that you're a Year 12 student. Enter your Year 12 student number and a four-digit UAC PIN. It's important to do this because it allows us to match your end-of-year results to your application. It also means you'll be able to apply for the school's recommendation scheme. If you're a New South Wales HSC student or an ACT Senior Secondary Certificate student, we emailed you your four-digit UAC PIN in April. So, enter your NESA or BSSS student number and then the UAC PIN in that email. If you're an IB student or you're studying an Australian Year 12 qualification in another state, enter your student number. Then for your UAC PIN, use the four digits of your date of birth. For example, if your birthday is 3rd of October, your UAC PIN will be 0310. The help text here gives examples of student numbers and UAC PINs. Once you've entered your student number and UAC PIN, click Continue to move to the Personal Details page. Because you've given us your student number and registered your email address, some of your details will have already been added. Make sure they are correct and enter any missing information. For example, enter your government issue unique student identifier. You need it to enroll and get a help loan. Here's a link to apply for a USI if you don't already have one. On this page, you can also authorize a friend or relative to act on your behalf. And you can list any disabilities or illnesses you might need support with at uni. When you click Next, your UAC application number will be displayed. We'll also send you an email with a record of your application number. You'll need it to contact us about your application. Click Continue to move through to the Qualifications page. Your Year 12 qualification will have already been added. You have the option to add other qualifications. But as a Year 12 student, these usually won't apply to you. Only full-time employment of one year or more can be assessed so don't enter any information about casual or part-time jobs. Click Next to continue. The Course Preferences page is where you choose the courses you'd like to apply for. You can include up to five courses. If you're not sure about the courses you've chosen, don't worry. You can always change them later. Click Search for Courses to get started. First, select the institutions you're interested in, or select All. The courses available at those institutions will be displayed. To refine the search results, you can enter the six-digit course code from the UAC website course search, or you can enter a course name or campus. To add a course to your preference list, select the start date. Place your courses in order of preference. First on your list should be the course you'd most like to do, followed by your second, third, fourth and fifth choices. The order is important because if you miss out on getting an offer to your first choice, you'll be considered for your second one and so on. When you're done, save your changes to continue. Now you need to review your application. Check your details carefully and click the pencil icon next to any part of the summary to go back and make more changes. Once you're happy, click the submit button. Read through the declaration and tick the box to agree with its terms and accept that the application fee is not refundable. Now it's time to make your payment. You can use a credit card or a PayPal account, or you can pay later using BPAY. If you choose to pay later, be aware that you can't receive any offers until UAC receives your payment. Once you pay or commit to pay later, 
Your application is complete. It's a good idea to download and save your confirmation of application for your records. You can now apply for other schemes or scholarships. You can log back into your application at any time between 7.30 a.m. and midnight to upload documents, change your course preferences, track your application, change your password, and check your offers. Just remember that most offers to Year 12 students won't be made until December, after ATARs have been released. If you have any questions about your application, call our customer service team or use our online inquiry form.